Hello everyone, welcome back for another video. I thought this week we could do something very casual, not so structured. I realized that summer is going by so fast and it kind of freaks me out to be honest, but I've been having so much fun with just dressing up and just enjoying the warm season but i thought i would do a summer favorites video to kind of savor the time that we have left honestly you know i do a lot of outfits here and there but i realized that for the most part i'm actually wearing the same thing just a different variation of you know of mix and matching different pieces I'm the type of person that if I like something, like for example, like if I'm eating something um, and I really like it, I can literally eat it every day and not get sick of it. Uh, that's just kind of the person that I am. And so that also goes with my outfits and clothing and that good stuff. So I thought, why not make a video out of it? So here we are. Let's, I, I don't know if my glasses are, are they distracting? They might be, huh? Hold on a second. Let me fix that. All right, so I have taken us down to the floor. Let's go ahead and proceed. I will leave everything in the description box down below. As always, feel free to DM me if you have any questions um, on Instagram at Katherine Lane. I love to be able to talk to you guys like one-on-one -on -one and just chat with you guys on there. So yes, let's go ahead and get on with the video. <laughs> All right, so let's first talk about clothes. One thing that I have been wearing constantly are button-ups. This one that I have here is a new one that I got from the Frankie shop. I don't know, this will even be cute right now. Yeah, I guess so. It's one of those things that you can literally wear over anything. And I like to get it more oversized. I feel it totally changes an outfit, whether you want to just wear it by itself and just have it buttoned up with your whatever bottoms that you want to wear or just leaving it open for a cover-up on the beach stuff like that such a versatile piece it's just such a casual laid-back look that i find myself going to a lot lately the things that i usually wear are a button-up some type of shirt or tank top and flowy pants which brings me to my next item i really love wearing flowy pants this season especially if you have the right top i think if you mix textures so for example i have this one here from the frankie shop as well i'm not really sure what the material is i feel like if you mix this with like linen or just different textures it's comfortable one thing i don't like is wearing constricting fabric i like to keep my clothing items breathable loose these ones are the frankie shop i also love the one from jerf avenue this one is the ash on the go pants you guys have seen this a lot i don't think i need to go into detail but again the fabric is very light it's loose and it's just one of those things that is so easy to throw on and it's very very comfortable and this with some cute sandals is my go-to looks these days speaking of sandals i have a couple of them in front of me one brand that i constantly am wearing are tiki's i don't think i have mentioned tiki's in my videos before but on instagram i'm always wearing them i will also leave a link down below if you want a discount on your purchase what i love about tiki's is the minimal design and the more neutral color palette that is perfect for like a classic elevated look to your outfits and I realized that all the ones I'm gonna share with you are black and that's only because I love the look of just black sandals there's something very classy about it what's cool about tiki's is they have a variety of different colors for the most part they're very neutral very muted but i do know that they have released some colors in their essentials sets the ones i want to share with you are the slides they're the caro slides in black these are very very comfortable to me and i think the way that it looks with some crop jeans are really cute i just think a good pair of black sandals specifically it's something that you can wear easily with different pieces i also have one that's similar if you don't like the slides look these are sandals i think they're they're either the emma or the senna i have to double check but i'll i'll write it down below but these are also a pair in black 
as you can see um, they're very similar styles these are more sandals like I wear these a lot and I think it's a very classic minimal sandal to have also really good quality as well another sandal that I I'm always wearing it. I also have it in black, but they have it in brown too. Uh, but these are the St. Agni Oliver Slides. These are really classy and I'm starting to really love just like a thicker strap on the thong. I think it gives it a more elevated look. I love the shape of it. I love the square toe. St. Agni has such beautiful quality leather. A good thong sandal is nice to have for the summer. I think it's so versatile, especially one with a thick strap. I think it elevates the look a lot more. The next items I want to bring up are, I can't really see it because I mean, I'm sitting down, but what I have here are slip dresses. This one, you guys have already seen. <laughs> <laughs> This one you guys have already seen in my last haul on Jerf Avenue, so I'm not going to go too much into it, but slip dresses in general, whether it be whatever color, whatever style, I love this for weddings. A lot of weddings are happening. I have been going to slip dresses pretty often. Um, it doesn't even have to be a wedding, but just like a nice dinner or just something you like just a nice evening out or an event. When it's really, really hot, I think the more light the fabric and flattering the fabric, the better. And I think with slip dresses, there's always something so elegant, so timeless about it. This one is the one from Aritzia. I think it's the Wilfred slip dress. Um, I will link it down below, but this is the color sage green, if I'm not mistaken. I wore this to my friend's wedding recently, and it was just one of those dresses that I could just let loose. I can just feel confident, free. You know, you can wear it in the summer, but I think there's so many good ways to style it as well in the wintertime. Love slip dresses, especially for more formal events. One of the basic pieces that I've been wearing a lot recently are tank tops or like racerback tank tops but just like tank tops like this the one i always wear is the jerf um, avenue tank top which you've seen before um this one is a cropped one from uncle studios sometimes i feel like when you're wearing something like a flowy pant that could kind of be a statement piece depending on what type of pants that you're wearing like for example this frankie pant has a little bit more detail which i think could be a bit of a statement piece so to kind of tone it down i like to wear something that's a little more structured a little more laid back so tank tops like this simplifies the outfit and makes it look more chic so i love doing having these in my wardrobe i want to go ahead and get into some bags same thing with bags i have just been wearing the same ones just in rotation basically. This one is the by far off-white croc amber bag. I honestly was very hesitant because I was like, one, is it too trendy? Two, is the price worth it? But after wearing it so many times, I feel like it's also a good size as well. I think white is nice for more of like the warmer seasons. Another bag I wanted to mention is this bag from Samara. This is the tote in the color sand i believe and this was actually gifted to me for one of their campaigns and i have found myself to be using this a lot lately and this is actually i think it's vegan leather i use it for work and i put my laptop in here i like to just even take it out for example if i'm going out i'm going to like a picnic or to the beach i think it's the perfect bag for that because you can carry so many different things i've spoken to some of the people from the team and they're very very nice and one thing that i also want to keep in mind when it comes to shopping is the people who are behind the brand and samara and jerk avenue specifically like i have learned how much heart and how much intention is is put out when it comes to the different things that they create for their brand and every move they make on social when it comes to their products is very thought out and intentional and they're also just very very nice so i try my best to support brands like that samara i highly highly recommend i feel like they have so many 
things that are up and coming and I'm very, very excited to see what's in store. I wanna get into some hair accessories. This one is a scarf, actually. I was thinking like the different ways to wear it. What I think is so good about scarves like this, especially during the summertime, is when you have a very toned down color palette in your wardrobe and you don't wanna invest in pieces that have too much color because you are afraid if it's too trendy or you know it's not something that you would wear very often. I think what's great about like accessories like this is you don't have to drop like top dollar on a piece that you can just add a hint of color to. For example, this scarf right here, like so many different ways that you can wear it. Um, I personally like to wear it, I'll put in a picture here, you put your hair in a ponytail or a bun and tie it around, or you can wear it as a top, or you can take your bag and tie it in the corner like this adds a cute pop of color next accessory that i really love is the it's called the big effing hair clip from the brand mej and this is the color buttercream they have so many cute colors so many different designs they have like this really cute flower one but you know your girl loves her neutrals so i stuck to a more neutral palette you know i know that there's a lot of clips out there and it's very easy to get but what I love about this is how much it just holds my hair and makes it feel super secure. Especially for the days where I'm just like, I don't want to deal with it. I don't want to deal with my life right now. I just want to, or I feel like I want to deal with it. I want to take care of it. I want to be able to tackle life and I'm just going to put my hair up because I don't want anything to get in my way. This is definitely that clip. Where I'm just like, I'm going to get some work done. We're going to get it done today. Like it's happening. Okay, this is like not the cutest way for to wear it. Like there's so many cute ways to wear it, but just just don't take my styling right now as an example. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. For the hot days, I like to just keep them in my purse or you can just like clip it on your bag and have it ready to go. Last but not least, I want to share with you guys my favorite makeup products, especially for the summertime and it's no surprise they are from Merit. Honestly, you guys, I kid you not always always going to these especially during this warm season because i don't like to wear too much foundation i like to keep it very minimal as much as possible when i had mentioned in my video i continued using it and still love it to this day this is the foundation stick in the color khaki i like to just wear this under my eyes or on blemishes that i want to cover up a little bit even if i want to put it all over my face it doesn't feel too cakey it doesn't feel too much and my skin still comes through whenever i wear this and then also the merit shade oil in the color au natural yeah honestly this is probably going to be a product that i'm always going to wear and i love the way it feels it's super hydrating i love the shade and the formula is so so nice all right that is it i apologize if the video was all over the place if i was all over the place but i just really wanted to get this video out i didn't want to think too much about it sometimes it's nice to just kind of be in the moment just chill just talk to you guys and be casual i feel like the pressure is lifted sometimes when i have to like set up my camera and stand in front of it have like a whole rack of stuff and like my notes and when i get into that zone i'm not fully able to just be myself you know so that's why i wanted to just keep this one very casual i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you guys have any questions on anything anything at all feel free to comment down below come say hi or you can also dm me on instagram at katherine elaine and i will chat with you guys on there anyways i will see you guys in the next one thank you so much for joining me this week i'll catch you later love you bye Mwah.